Oh, Bobby, look how the light catches that leather. A long way from your Letterman sweater days, huh? This has been great fun, Serena. Uh-huh. I had a wonderful time. I'm glad you called. When I heard you're in town, I had to see you. I don't usually keep in touch with too many people from high school. I don't think they approved of me. Yeah, it's the same with me and my old man. Are you two still at it? You know, I think his real problem is my cigars. He can't stand the smell. Well, I guess it's better not being able to stand you. That's not far from the truth either, I'm afraid. Come on, let's have some more stories. Okay. Huh? Hey, what are you doing? What are you, right here, something? Hey! Hey. Oh. Hey, don't call the police, lady. Save your dime for the kid's father. Don't listen to him, Sarita. Tell the old man. He'll be hearing from us. in seeking help in finding Bobby. How well did you know Bobby? Oh, I hadn't seen him for years until yesterday. We went shopping. He always liked my taste in clothes. But did he say anything about anybody being after him or threatening him? No. We were talking about the old days and the leather jacket he just bought. He liked it so much he wore it right out of the shop. And you've never seen those two men who grabbed him before? No, never. Have you seen him since? I'm not involved in the kidnapping, if that's what you think. Oh, no, no, no. We didn't say that. I wanted to help him. But all I could do was sit there with a broken heel. I feel like such a fool. Why don't you calm down, OK? I suppose you're right. Why don't you help me with these plants into the house? I really shouldn't get this upset before a show. It hurts my performance. Oh, you're an actress. Yes, I have to do a matinee. Sabrina, do you think you'd be able to identify these men? In a flash. But how are you even going to begin to look for them? Well, we could start out with the car. You obviously got a good look at it. I didn't get the license plates. It was an old junker. That really narrows it down. Except this was the noisiest, fastest old junker I've ever seen. It drove like a race car. Hello. It's for you, Carol. Oh, thank you. Hello. We'll be right over. Bye. The kidnappers just contacted Mr. Warren. Please help, Bobby. He's really very special to you, isn't he? He's the only person that's always been nice to me. Don't worry. So why don't we just, you're gonna love this, why don't we just go out and ban some nice young millionaires? Sydney, we came here to find White and to get some information. Okay. Okay. We're closed for the evening. Unless you're here for the audition. Yes. No. Yes. has more cheesecake than Sarah Lee. The only thing I don't see around anywhere are men. Maybe Dwight works in the bar or something. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I always have two left feet when I audition. You haven't seen a good-looking guy around the club lately, have you? His name is Dwight Farrell. Honey, if there were any good-looking men around here, they wouldn't be waiting for me. Well, there's a girl who really tells it like it is. Let's just find out who's in charge around here. All right, you two are next. Let's go. Come on, we've got to go all day. Come on, come on, girls. Look sharp. It's getting late. Let's see those legs. I think you've made some mistake. My only mistake was not finding you two sooner. Very convincing. Wig is fantastic. But I know, just hold on a minute here. Bring out the stage, Joe. Carol, 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 Carol,
Terrific. You're hired. Beat it. Next! Oh, good work, girls. Checking the office on your way out. Oh, yeah, sure. How did we get ourselves into these things? Stop complaining. We got the job, didn't we? Watch it, Twinkle Toes. Did you hear what I just heard? Uh-huh. Either she has a very bad cold or... These women are too beautiful, too perfect, too, too, to be anything but men. Right. Well, how will we know for sure? Watch this. Hey, I'm not that kind of girl, sweetheart. Sorry, babe. Who could tell? Hey, what'd I tell you? Well, if all these women are really men, we must be in the wrong place. All right, everybody, you want to keep it quiet, please? Let a star sing. You want to watch? I'm game. My funny valentine Sweet comic valentine You make me smile With my singer look familiar? Serena. And this must be where she works. Serena! Right here, Serena, Wait. Stop. Serena! What kind of shortness is this? Who are these two broads? I just didn't see any reason to. Well, when we saw you at your apartment, you were still dressed like a woman. Part of the business, trying new looks, seeing what works, what doesn't. Why did you follow us? Stay close to see if I could help. Guilt, I guess. Guilt about what? If I'd been Dwight, I would have been able to help Bobby. As it was, I couldn't do a thing. I got the part, and I wanted to thank you for the good work, Serena. You're welcome. You two kill me. I mean, I could spend six weeks in the beauty shop, but I'd never look as much like a woman as you. Well, it's all in the walk. Yeah, maybe that's it. Hmm. Now, if you don't mind me asking, what was your relationship with Bobby Warren? We've been friends since we were kids. I had a pretty rough time of it in high school. He was the only one that was my friend. What were you doing in New York? How do you know I was in New York? Well, I, I just happened to find this at the car dealership. It was the last city I called home. I travel a lot, singing in nightclubs. We have to make something perfectly clear. Sydney and I want to help Bobby just as much as you do, but we have to do things our own way. That nutty driver proves that the kidnappers want us off the case. They might be desperate. They might try to kill Bobby. Well, that's why we have to get him away from them, now. In other words, mind my own business and stay out of your way. I wouldn't put it that way exactly, but... But in a word, yeah. Okay. Good night. Good night.
right, son? I'm all right now, Dad. These guys... What are they doing here? Same thing your henchmen's doing. It's making sure everybody gets what they want. Yeah, I told you to come alone. Are we just gonna go around and around and around all day or what? Come on, let's get this over with. That's the man who was in the back seat of our car. Yeah. And I still got my gun, too. Now can we get on with it? I'm sorry about this mess, Dad. It's all right, as long as you're all right. As long as you've got the plans. I've got the plans. You get these when you let my son go. First, I gotta make sure they're the real thing. Just a minute. You get nothing till he puts that gun away. Didn't Serena say that Bobby was wearing a new leather jacket when he was kidnapped? Well, how did he get a change of clothes? The same way he'd get the cigars in the garage. Sydney, Bobby must be in on it. He couldn't wait the five years to get the money. Mr. Warren, don't give him those plans. What the hell is this? Give us those plans. Bobby, what are you doing? I'm taking what's mine, Dad. I'm your father. Yeah, that's what you keep telling me. But all my life, all you did was take stuff away from me, Dad. Sydney! Oh. Oh. Let's outsmart him. You're right. Let's see how good Warren's turbo really is. We got him now, Bobby boy. We got the plans. Yeah. But I'm gonna ram those dames for getting in my business. No? Not yet. Let it get a little closer. Turbo. Nice going, Cha-Cha.
Not so brave in the front seat. Wanna go shopping sometime, Bobby? Well, he looks like a woman, but he hits like you. We finally got it all together. This is it. This was it, you mean. All our guests are over an hour late. I know. I can understand your friends being late. They're not exactly reliable. Well, what about your white collar types? They're always supposed to be punctual. This is the uh, living room. It's lovely. And to think that you run it all. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> we just wouldn't know what to do without Shane. He's modest, but indispensable. Well, come on, Serena. I want to show you what I do at the upstairs. Mm -hmm. I like her. She's different. You know, I kind of feel like we've got a lot in common. Oh, talk to me. Didn't you tell Shane about Serena? I thought you did. Well, you'll find out soon enough. They're here. 